Today we're going to look at web scraping using ParseHub and Parabola. In this video, we're just going to briefly go over what web scraping is and how to get set up with ParseHub and Parabola so that we can look at a couple of different use cases for working with these tools. So what is web scraping? Web scraping can typically be thought of as a two-step process. The first being extracting data from a website. For us, this is where we'll be using ParseHub. And the second part of the web scraping process is transforming the data that you've collected into a format that is more useful for the user. For instance, a searchable database or directory. Parabola is an awesome tool for transforming data. And Parabola also has a built-in Parsub integration, which is great. Web scraping may seem a little bit scary, but if you've ever copied and pasted something from a website, which I'm certain we've all done, then you already have experience with pretty much the most basic form of web scraping. Tools like ParseHub simply automate those actions for us so that we can save time. For this tutorial, you will need a Parabola account. You can sign up for free at parabola.io, as you can see here. And you'll also need to create a ParseHub account and download the ParseHub desktop app, which is also free from parsehub.com. Just a note, if you are planning on using a scheduler to run your web scraping in the future, that is a paid feature on ParseHub, but it is free to get started. There are so many different use cases for web scraping. Over the next few videos, we're going to look at two different use cases to give you an idea of what you can do with ParseHub and Parabola. First, we'll look at creating a central database for adopting a pet in your local city. Creating a central database or directory is a very common use case for web scraping. Many job boards would fall into this category as well. The second use case that we'll look at is more on the data analytics side of things, where we'll be pulling stats from Major League Baseball so that you or a baseball fan that you know can dominate your fantasy league. Let's get started.